On this video at Doug's Home Arcade, showcasing my Qbert arcade video game by Gottlieb. This was actually not a game that I played when it came out. Actually, no one had this game. I think I might have played it once somewhere at an arcade that was not local by my house. But I did play a lot of this on my Atari 2600 and I loved the game a lot just based on that so when it was time to build this personal collection this was a must and I bought this game I think it was around 1999 right around there and it's been actually a very good machine haven't done nothing to it the only thing I did do was a modification and it runs off the original board so you can hit the two buttons here and it should go to the main menu and it actually run the multi Qbert so you can choose from Qbert Cubert Cubes, which uh, is a really fun uh, game and hard if you could find that in an uh, actual Cubert machine. And uh, faster or more challenging Cubert. And there's some other uh, games that really don't work in here because of the joystick. It makes it kind of impossible to play, but there's a cool um, mellow yellow version of uh, Cubert. And then a 7 Eleven Cubert as well. Already. And so I'm just going to Qbert here. Actually, I did replace the control panel, the panel overlay. It was pretty torn up now that I recall. So this was done quite some time ago. But still has the original side art on both sides. Overall pretty pretty clean machine. Does have the credit knocker on the bottom too, which is a really good addition to have on your Qbert. If it doesn't work, I suggest getting it fixed. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and uh, pause for a moment and we'll get a game started so you can see in action.
Oh, it's 